what is up guys so today i'm going to show you how to download shao or air shao and if you guys don't know what happened with air shao uh recently if you uh re-downloaded it for some reason uh and you tried logging in using the shao.tv um it'll bring up the screen you know when you go into the app it'll say oh log in using shao.tv uh when you clicked on it it'll take you to the app store or the actual app and then it wouldn't uh, once you logged in, it wouldn't actually do anything when you get back onto the recorder. So I'm going to show you how to actually do it in a, how to download Xiao and how to log in using a new method. So you're going to have to get the dis this um, link from the description. Of course, I have it loaded already. Uh, so I'm going to just refresh it. And then it'll ask you this. Would you like to open in the App Store? Uh, you'd press open. And then this would pop up. The Would you like to install Air Xiao? You'd press install, of course. Uh, I'm not pressing it because I'm recording for obvious reasons. It would probably ruin the recording. All right, so I'm gonna use screenshots from my iPad to do this because I couldn't do it from my phone. Um, so what you're gonna have to do once you get the app is when you click it, it'll show something like, oh, untrusted enterprise. So what you're gonna do is go onto your settings, uh, go onto general, go to profiles, and then you're gonna have to click on the one that says enterprise or Weiss enterprise or something. Uh, you need to click that one, you click uh, trust, then you click trust again, and then that's it. You go straight back to the app and then uh, you click on it, it'll show the whole thing again, like sign, sign in through uh, Shout.TV. Uh, you click it and then it'll bring up this screen and you can log in through Google+, uh, Facebook, or Twitter, or email. And that's pretty much it, so you don't even have to use the Shout.TV app anymore. You just record and sign in straight from the same app, so I think that's pretty cool. And uh, that's pretty much the tutorial. Um, so yeah, if you guys enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. What is up guys, so today I'm going to show you how to download music onto your iOS device without having a computer and without being jailbroken. So you're just going to need the Puffin Browser and the Google Drive app. And assuming you've already logged in...